I and other observers of the California legislature have often noted its increasing level of what you might call polarization. Uh, more liberal Democrats, more conservative Republicans, and fewer in the middle from either party. It turns out, however, according to a study conducted by a couple of political scientists, that California's legislature is the most polarized of any, in the, of any state. By far, in fact, uh, with uh, Louisiana a fairly distant second. The political science studied voting records and other data over the last 20 years to come to that conclusion. And what does it mean? Oh, well, maybe nothing. Maybe it's healthy. Maybe it's healthy that the two parties fight a lot and don't agree. Or maybe it's unhealthy because they don't agree to do things that need to be done. There's not even an agreement as to whether polarization is bad or good. Sometimes when they're all too cozy, they get together and do things and nobody ever gets to argue about it. And that's probably not good. But on the other hand, if all they do is argue, that's not particularly good either. But whatever the goodness or the badness of it, California's legislature does appear to be the most polarized in the country. And by the way, what's the least polarized legislature in the country? Well, it's Rhode Island, as a matter of fact. Should we be like Rhode Island? Well, that's for another time.